Hey, oh. <laughs> I'm Mark. Yeah. That's Adam. We're back. And we are back. <laughs> I know. Right out of, right of hibernation because RMC is making some news. That yeah. Oh, yeah. We come over a hole for. RMC um, did a little teasing. Yes, they did. To get all those coaster enthusiasts riled up. Yep. And I'm going to read you I'm that. Riled up. So uh, the other day they did an ask, an ask me anything on Reddit, mm -hmm. a thread, so people could ask them a question. Someone asked them about doing... Uh, Somebody asked them this. Have you been to the chain lift store? Because you should, because they have amazing shirts. Now what did RMC say? <laughs> they said, well, I'll check it out. That's what they said. <laughs> Alan Shilke was like, mm, those are Shilke yeah. smooth <laughs> shirt designs. I'm going to buy one. Yeah. And he probably did. I just yeah. made that up, but he probably did. Yeah. Anyway, so someone asked them about about them doing a Giga Coaster in the future. And I'm going to read you their response. There really is more coming. Not going to get too specific, but we're excited for what the future holds. Trust us, RMC is focused on continuing to make new innovations within the coaster community. It's going to be awesome. You sound like a robot. <laughs> now, here's the, here, here's, here's the thing about it. Here's yeah, because if you look at it... They strategically capitalized. Well, sure, I did because I put it on the screen. Yeah, they capitalized some of the letters. Yeah. And what do those letters spell out? RMC Giga coming. Yeah. So that's huge news. It also really on top of it, they also, somebody asked about a T-Rex. They said that news of that is coming soon. Mm -hmm. So this is probably a package deal, I would assume. I would assume a T-Rex is, you yeah. do a Giga, I mean. When I'm. Yeah, they haven't built a T-Rex yet, but I'm thinking Giga, it seems like a T-Rex would make more sense. It could be separate. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, obviously, you're, it's, it's a complete guessing game. Mm -hmm. What, Like which park's going to get it. Sure. Yeah. Um, you know, Cedar Point's always going to be brought up. I, this doesn't sound like a Cedar Point thing to me. No. In the next few years, because we all yet. know what the drags are stuff. Yeah. This is their next priority, for probably twenty twenty four. It's not Six Flags. Um, I don't. It's definitely not Six. Yeah, definitely not Six that, Flags. It'd be very unlike them to do that. You're not gonna get like a Holiday World. Can you would put a Giga Coaster in? Uh, even a T Rex, probably. I no. wouldn't think. No. I, um, I you know I, I think there might be you know I think maybe Hershey Park. This could be a Hershey Park thing potentially. You know I don't know if they're gonna turn Wildcat into a Giga Coaster, but maybe they just demolish it and just. Build a ground up Giga Coaster or T Rex Giga Coaster. That's a possibility. Possible. Uh, it could be overseas. Mm -hmm. uh, we Energy don't, Landia. Energy Landia just buys them like their cereal. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yes. They pump the coasters in. But your thought, and some people's thoughts, I think it's the best one. I think it makes yeah. most sense. The one that makes most sense to me would be Bush Gardens Williamsburg. Back in the land that used to be home to Drock and Fire. It's a large plot of land. It's that that land before COVID was supposed to be home to a future Giga shuttle coaster, affectionately called Drock and Spire. Yep. But it seems like well those plans got pushed back, and then now mm. it kind of seems like they might be shelved permanently. And well, the new rumor is oh, that um, Bush Gardens may be looking to work with castle, RMC for the, the next castle. new coaster. They had soil samples in a bigger area now than mm -hmm. what it originally was, which yeah. obviously suggests you need more room for a Giga coaster. Mm -hmm. That's not that's a non shuttle. So yeah, check out BGW fans too. To, you can find out any information about Bush Gardens and Limburg. They know yeah. everything on that. They're always right. They're the best follow for Bush Gardens, bar yep. on Williamsburg. Yep, for sure. And plus. Uh, Bush Gardens, Tampa, they just opened Iron Gwazi to huge success. Yep. It was rated the best coaster of 2022 by the Golden Ticket yep. Awards. Uh, so you, it would make sense that they would want to work with RMC again. And much like Energy Landia, they've been buying coasters. Oh, SeaWorld Entertainment, yeah. I like their cereal. Every year, everyone's getting a coaster. Yep. So those Bush Gardens makes the most sense to me. I threw out to Mark earlier that maybe Silver Dollar City. I, but it seems I'm, unlikely. I'm pretty skeptical about that. Yeah. Uh, it is my favorite park. Yeah. <laughs> I like your but, voice. But, yeah. Uh, they're pretty, like, landlocked. It's not a huge park. It's beautiful, it's, but... I will say, it's hard to tell with that park because most of the coasters go away from the... Yeah. Uh, the center of the park. They all kind of go out. So I don't know how much land they own, like, around the perimeter I'd be, I mean, I'd be of the park. I'd be thrilled if they did, but... Yeah. My, Williams River makes the most sense to mm -hmm. me. I think Hershey Park... Chocolate? It's certainly a, a dark horse in this. 
But again, it could be some overseas too, so we don't know. Um, but the Draken Fighter area with the soil samples and the news that they were going to build a giga, a giga coaster before anyway. Yeah, it just right. makes a lot of sense to me. Yeah, and so. they've been kind of been rumored to be getting a giga coaster for like five or six years oh, yeah. for different reasons. And then COVID happened, and it kind of slowed them down. Yeah. And I will say with RMC2, they seem very excited about the future because they've had some tweets over the summer about, like, they're really excited about some of the projects that they're working on. And if only you could, if we knew what they're working on, how excited we'd well, be. they should so, be excited. They're like yeah. the leading innovators right now. Yes, they, yeah, they do so, awesome, awesome job. So if it is going to go on that spot, I, I contend it's called Rock and Fire. Oh, yeah. Bring the name back. I love the name. That's yeah. one coaster. Uh, I wish I would have rode. Mm -hmm. I would have loved to grade yeah. out on that thing. That one and Son of Beast are yeah. the two. I would have loved to grade uh, out on that bag. <laughs> yeah. I would have loved to have spine injured room. my back on It would have been those. worth it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Comment in the section below and tell us how much you grade out or broke your back on one of those two yeah. coasters. Or let us know where you think this RMC coaster could be going. There's a spider coming down right in front of my face right now. <laughs> it is the season. Halloween. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where it went, but you guys saw that, right? Yeah. Uh, leave a comment. Let us know where you think this RMC coaster could be going or your wish list of where it could be going. Follow us on the Instagrams, the Twitters, mm -hmm. podcasts. We don't ever do one, but we are <laughs> going to do one soon, I promise. Yeah. Because we're going to go over our summer. Mm -hmm. um, I'm out of here because I don't want to add any more. <laughs> Bye. See ya. Amusement parks, roller coasters, main attraction, the entertaining satisfaction. We are the chain link.